Hi, I'm Josh Som, and tonight I'm trying a Shiraz. Shiraz is not something I typically drink, I will be honest with you, because I don't feel like you can get really quality wine for under about $30 in the Shiraz category. That said, this one was about 28 bucks, and it is an absolute showstopper. Wow, you know, like on the nose, you have these incredible bouquet of aromatics that change and develop, and you just you keep going and going. Like, for example, you have like this beautiful kind of musky molasses, dark fruit, vanilla, um, smokiness, vanilla and smoke. That's typically synonymous with uh, aged, barrel aged wine. So you can tell that this wine, Gibson Shiraz 2016 from the Barossa Valley, it's spent a bit of time in an oak barrel. So yeah, you get that that character of smokiness, like I just, like I had a thing of pan ham soup on the slow cooker, so, you know, I was thinking, well, is it just, can I just smell the dinner, but it's definitely there, and I implore you to make your own judgment on this, this is a highly recommended wine, you do have to try it, um, but yeah, that sort of musk molasses, like, um, cherry ripe, like dark, like I'm thinking the cherry ripe wrapper, like, you know, when you open up a cherry ripe and, you know, not one that's like on the bottom of your slipper, but like one that you've just freshly opened and yeah, it's that special edition dark chocolate. But let's taste it. Oh. Look, I like to say that it's the first time I tasted this one tonight, but as you can see from my teeth, I've been sipping on this little baby for uh, a little while now. But the the flavours are really well complemented by each other. So you have this balance of acidity and the, the typical Shiraz sort of pepperiness, but it's bold and it's got that fruit and it's easy to drink. And I almost want to say, like, it does kind of mirror a, a Pinot Noir. So if you're a Pinot Noir drinker, I think this one, and you want to step it up a bit, you know, like you've seen your... You've seen your mates, maybe their names are like Damo or Gussie and they're just, you know, laying down bricks and they're, you know, laying down the stakes like they're, they're bricks and they just drink Shiraz because it pairs so well with that. Like, try it. Try it with your beef. Try it with your steak. Try it with your bricks. You're going to love this wine. I'm Josh Song and I'm a bricklayer.